Hey YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's big country time and we're back at it again with some more mystery boxes. So here we are. We are here with a mystery grail box. I know, I know. I said I was going to stick away from these, but I've had these this box right here since it says May 16th. So I was looking through my emails and this is either a pop and soda box or this is going to be a Star Wars um, what does it say it was a Star Wars something uh, I just I just had it up here where is it so this may be the midweek Star Wars mystery grill box so if it's that box, I have a lot of chances of getting some Star Wars grills. So, um, you know, we'll see. Hopefully it's a Star Wars one. If not, it'll be a pop and soda. And then I have a couple boxes from Walmart. Um, these have also been sitting around for a while. Uh, these are going to be the last of my, my boxes I have for a while. So, um, we'll see what we get. I already know what these Walmart ones are. Um... This box came in pretty good, but um, this one, we will see if, if there's any damage. And there's a little accordion action going on right there. So uh, we'll probably open, we'll open that one first. We'll open the Mystery Grills last, and like how I usually do it, we'll open these up, and then uh, we'll check out the prices after we open them up. All right, so I'm just going to drop that off over there. And got the trusty old knife. How's everyone doing out there? Hopefully everyone's doing amazing. We're already into February. We have February the Super Bowl coming up pretty soon. We got my Eagles gonna be playing Kansas City. Playing a little against Andy Reid, former former coach of the Eagles. It'd be nice to see uh, the Eagles uh, you know put a whooping on his uh, his coaching style. Right, so here we go. Walmart. There's three pops. These are all hard stack pops. Art series. All right. So you guys probably already know what pops released at Walmart. So I, I ordered these a long time ago. So ooh, Dark Vader Hoth. That one's pretty badass. That one's nice. I like that one. Stacks are clean. Um, but yeah, that's, that is sweet. Okay, so here you go. Darth Vader Hoth. All right. We got, uh, got another one right here. Ooh, here we go. This one is Darth Vader Indoor. One's a little bit darker. You can see all the tree bark and leaves on him. The other one, stack is nice. No issues. All right. That. All right, here's the third one. So there was only three in this. There'll be one more in the other box. So there was a total of four art series from Walmart a while back ago. Oh, that one's nice. Darth Vader Mustafar. I don't know. Between this one and Hoth, I don't know which one's better. That's pretty nice, pretty nice. Look at that. Slide that over here as we open them up. So, so that was just the three. Accordion action was in the area where there was no pop. That was the corner where there was nothing there. They had a little bubble wrap in there to protect it. So good job, Walmart. All right, so this should be the fourth one in here. Man, I waited a long time to open those. I had a little break when I remodeled this room. And then I just slowly getting mystery boxes in. Um, so no mystery boxes left in my room. I did just order one today. They had, um, had a couple Star Wars pops uh, available in their uh, 
they're grouping. So always when there's a good Star Wars and a few other ones within the Grails, premium Grails, I like to try to order them. I think uh, the one that was really available was uh, Stormtrooper uh, Koei or Rex, one of those two. Alright, so here, this one is Darth Vader Bespin. Um, pretty cool, pretty cool. I probably have to say it's between Mustafar and Hoth are my favorites. So you can kind of get a close for that one. So we'll put those off to the side. So there you go, Mustafar. All right, that's one of my top ones. Oh, we have Hoth. That's one of my favorites. What do you guys think? You tell me which one of these four is your favorite. Close up. And then there's this best bin. They're all really awesome. I'm going to have to find a place where to put them. I thought I saw a crack on here with just a, a line in the plastic crap. So as you can see, I have all my dark faders right here. Definitely going to have to move some stuff around because I just added four more dark faders to the set. All right. So, here we go, two Mystery Grill. I'm not, uh, like I said, I'm not sure um, what one it is, but like I said, it shipped out on May 16th. I'm trying to see if it shows what line it was from, it doesn't. So, we'll just have to go, hopefully it's the Star Wars one. I need some Star Wars pops. Don't have, don't have enough Star Wars. Uh, talking about Star Wars, uh, what do you guys think about all the pops that just released recently? There are so many Star Wars. Return of the Jedi. Uh, I do have to say, I did not order them all. I did not pre-order them. I only ordered um, the exclusive from Entertainment Earth. Alright, so look at it. Here we go. Star Wars. Awesome. Here we go. Star Wars. Cool. Alright, so man, I'm surprised I let this box sit around for so long. For whatever reason, I thought it was a pop and a soda. But yeah, new, new line of Star Wars. I only ordered the Entertainment Earth uh, exclusive. Um, we'll wait and see what happens with all the other ones. There's just so many. Oh, I'd rather wait and see uh, maybe the prices come down, maybe get in a mystery box. But I definitely ordered the exclusive. Alright, so here we go. Box one. Um, what we're looking for is we're looking for this sticker right here. Alright, if you guys know, if you guys are watching the channel, uh, I've only gotten two of these stickers and they were in the Christmas boxes all right so out of all these other mystery grail boxes I've yet to get a grail all right so maybe this would be at Star Wars all right here we go Star Wars what are we going to get one two three bomb oh no it's a CB6B all right so this is I've had a uh, I've had three of these. Uh, don't really. Th I think it's probably like fifteen. Not a whole lot of value, and it actually looks faded a little bit. Like it's not the right color in there. Uh, so yeah, that's kind of a dud. I already have it. We need some stuff that I don't have. All right, so. Gotta kind of scratch your candy, and there's the candy is it's, it's there's nothing there, so no candy for me. So not what really I was looking for. All right, all right. So hopefully the next one is something more amazing. Alright, I waited a long time for this box. It'd be nice to have a grail that was sitting there for months. 
All right, here we go. Last box, last mystery pop. What is it going to be? Is it going to be a grill? One, two, three. Bam! It's hand solo. It is an exclusive. Um, not bad. I think I have this one already. Um, yeah, right up there. Uh, we'll see which one is better. 2016 Summer Convention Exclusive. So, and I don't think this is a really ex expensive pop either, but it's better than CB6B. Alright, so we got the scratcher. And... And, uh... There's not even a candy in this one. All right, so that's, that's, I got one empty candy wrapper and then another box with no candy. So two duds, two duds. All right, so what we are going to do is, I think this is, is more valuable than the other one. Uh, what the heck? What is there? like a line that goes across. I'm not sure if that's the... Protector or the box? Let's check that out. So I think this one's more expensive than CB. I don't think either one of them are like super expensive. So yeah, this has a big old freaking crease across it. So not cool. Uh, not supposed to get damaged pops in these. That is just, uh, wow. Can you guys see that? It goes all the way across. So, not cool, not cool. I don't know, I think, I don't know if that's manufacture or damage or what, but without damage, I think it may be a little more than CB, whatever he is. So, more expensive than this as far as pop price guide and then we'll check out the value of these two or these two we'll see which ones are worth more all right so we'll be right back hey youtube we are back and uh we got our pop is right um yeah we had them in order nothing amazing so uh hand solo it is a whopping uh, $13, okay, so, and then with the damage, uh, I'll be lucky to maybe get half that. Um, and then we got the CB6B is only $8. So maybe back in May, they may have been a little more, um, not much more. Um, but hey, the art series, um, they're pretty nice, pretty nice. So we got Bespin over here. That comes in at $34. All right, so that's a little more than what I paid for it. Um, Mustafar, $44. All right, nice one, nice one. Uh, indoor, lowest one, 25. And the most expensive one, 47 for Hoth. So the two that I like the best are the ones that were more valuable. I guess everyone's kind of has the same taste. Uh, got my scratchers from Mystery Grab. I did pretty good. I got 1000 on one and 500 on other. So that kind of makes up for the flops. Uh, both duplicates. Um, and no grail. No grail. So now I think that's 0 and 23. 0 and 23. All right. So hopefully we do better on this next batch I ordered. Um, still looking to pick up a few other mystery boxes for the next few weeks um so if you see any that are out there let me know i'll be looking around uh boom loot toy usa um i don't know uh, ralphie's something like that or if there's something new out there let me know all right so big country time Ow.